New at 6, a lawsuit filed after a man dies in Knox County Sheriff's Office custody. That lawsuit comes with pictures, stills from body cam footage showing Jonathan Binkley hogtied, his ankles and wrists handcuffed together. We have some of the pictures here. We told you about Binkley's death last year. Now his mother is suing the Sheriff's Office, saying it was excessive force that led to her son's death. The lawsuit admits that the cause of death on Binkley's autopsy is drug intoxication made worse by obesity and heart disease, but the lawsuit claims that deputies pulled Binkley from the open window of a pickup truck after a chase when the truck became stuck against a tree. Also, it claims at one point an officer held his knee on Binkley's back while Binkley struggled to breathe. We should point out that the pictures included with the lawsuit do not show the officer with his knee on Binkley. We've requested the full body camera recording and asked the sheriff's office for comment. It's also worth noting that deputies gave Binkley Narcan and tried chest compressions, but to no avail. The lawsuit calls for damages of up to $4 million.